right, so we have an unboxing to take care of today. I got some cartoons in the background, Sonic the Hedgehog cartoon that just happened to be on Paramount Plus. And it's been a while since I've done an unboxing, but uh, I have two for today. I purchased a lot of items, about 20 of them. So you should be seeing um, many more unboxing videos. So I got my scissor here, and this first one is actually pretty small. It's not huge. Um, and uh, I bought these over the weekend, so I have no idea what it's going to be either. So once we, uh, once we, uh, get this area with the tape here, I should be able to just open it with my hand. See. And uh, oh, more tape. All right, I got it. Oh, I was not expecting this. Completely hit by surprise here. I can't believe how small this thing is. I've never owned one of these before. But I have just purchased a Sega Dreamcast. It came really fast. Um, so it says made in China. Uh, it looks a little dirty up, up front. It did not come with any cables. so. I don't think I'm going to be able to play it until the cables arrive. I had to order some cables on my own. So far, without having any power adapters or... Unless the one from the Sega Saturn will work, which I doubt. The power plug should work from the Saturn. But this thing looks pretty dirty. I'm willing to bet that I can get some of this dirt off. But uh, I can't believe how small these are. I've never, I've never actually owned one before. But now I own a Dreamcast. Sega Dreamcast. With no connections or power. So I'm gonna have to test it out and see if I can get it working. And without further ado, our next box, which is a much bigger box. I have no idea what this one is either. But like I said, I ordered 20 items. So we look forward to uh, opening up each and every one of them. So there's some tape over in this area here. This person used an old Amazon box, it looks like. So, so we'll cut through the tape here. We'll cut through it again on the, on the top. This actually looks like it's on the bottom here. Uh, lots of bubble wrap and paper and plastic bags. So I don't even know what I'm looking at here. Ah, this, this is a hint. I think I know what this is. So I got this silver metal thing so far. Some plastic bags and... and Bubble wrap. This is just a plastic bag. Wow, what is this? A bomb? No, it's not. It's just a plastic bag. It's pretty heavy though. But for this size of a plastic bag, whoever did this, it looks like they just threw the packaging in there. As long as it works and it doesn't have any damage, I don't care, but they used plastic bags, like, they just threw a whole bunch of bags. Look at this, they just tied a whole bunch of knots, like, this person did not know how to package stuff. Anyway, so we got our Dreamcast. This is a power plug for Sega. 
Uh, this is an RF adapter for Sega. And this metal thing, which gives a few clues and hints as to what this actually is. And let's not forget, there is another plug which says Sega on it. So two Sega plugs. And I'll just stuff all of this bubble wrap in. See what else we got here. I got a six button Sega controller that's used and it's an original one. We're not going to mess with that yet. I have another six button, con button controller that's used. It says Sega on it. It's the original one. Six button. Okay, and they're both six buttons. They're both, they both have the original adapters. That's good so far. Without further ado, this is supposed to be our real and actual system. Now it feels like this is smaller than it should be, I'm not sure why. There's a big knot here that I have to get out of this bag, unless I just rip the bag. I think I'll just rip the bag. There you go. Funny, I'm watching the Sonic the Hedgehog cartoons as I do this. All right, so we're down to one plastic bag, I hope. Ah, I wonder why. I didn't even know which, which item this was that I got. So there you have it. You can see it in the, in the bag. The 32X. Now, no idea what these parts are. It looks like there's a, a spacer for Sega CD. And that the uh, Genesis Model 2 with 32X with two of the original six button controllers to go with it and the AC adapters so we're gonna have to just test this thing out but it looks to be in, in very decent condition let me just see where it was made where it was made it says made in China so I got a Sega Genesis that was made in China. What does the 32X say? Uh, I can't. I can't see. Maybe it says something underneath. Ah, here we go. Uh, I don't see. It doesn't say say where it was made. But uh, a lot of these consoles are made in uh, China, the USA, or Japan. I guess it doesn't make that much of a difference if you have one from China versus one from the US or one from Hong Kong. But this is, is a, a Model 2 from China. I can't say what year it is, it doesn't say. Um, let me check the Dreamcast really quick. These are smaller than what I remember. I always thought they were bigger. The Dreamcast is really a big surprise to me because I thought this thing was going to be bigger, like the size of a Saturn. It says it, says it was made in June 2000. But this is, is the American version from June 2000. Um, hopefully everything works on it, but it didn't come with any connections. So I have these two systems to test today, really three systems. 32X Dreamcast, and they all arrived fast, um, and both of these were from sellers on eBay. 
Um, anyway, don't forget to comment. Don't forget to subscribe. There's going to be a lot more videos on the way. And uh, just by chance, we have a um, Sega video today because I received a Sega 32X, a Sega Genesis, and a Sega Dreamcast all on the same day with some controllers for Genesis and 32X and two plugs and the special metal splitter. Anyway, this is going to be awesome. I have some more videos on the way, more items on the way. So don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to like.